Hey, Will King here from High Cotton Homes in Florence, Alabama. And today I want to talk to you about reverse osmosis and specifically tankless reverse osmosis. This is the RO500 series from iSpring. Now this is going to be a 500 gallons per day system. You know, the first thing that sticks out to me when you see this unit, if you're familiar with reverse osmosis, is where's the tank? Where's all the hoses? Where's the filters? Everything looks totally different when you look at this unit. And you're right, it doesn't have a tank, and that's the beauty of the tankless reverse osmosis system. So this new unit from iSpring is all self-contained, so all the filters are inside the housing, and there's not a bunch of um, hoses and pipes going everywhere. You basically have three lines coming into the, to the top of this unit, and then everything else, all the other connections are self-contained inside this sleek cabinet, which is really nice. A lot of times on reverse osmosis systems, on the traditional systems with a tank, you have to have space to put it. And if you stick all of it under your cabinet, it may take up too much storage for you. So on a retrofit or a remodel, this really is a good option. You know, we build a lot of new houses in my business and we typically have room in mechanical rooms to integrate a reverse osmosis system in a large storage tank to go with it. But if you're remodeling or, or just retrofitting your current kitchen for um, filtered water, this really is a neat product to look at. So it has a built-in booster pump, which is gonna help increase the efficiency and the pressure. You know, if you know much about reverse osmosis, the way it works, it has a very tightly bound uh, fabric material and, it, and pressure forces the water through it and only the water molecules can come out and all the other things, contaminants, get flushed out as wastewater. Um, and speaking of wastewater, that's the beauty of this unit. You know, a traditional um, tank system is gonna have a one to two ratio of pure water to wastewater. Whereas you flip it for the tankless version like this, where it's two to one. So it's about 400% more efficient in terms of wastewater to pure water. So that's a big deal to a lot of people, especially depending on where you live. Um, if you take a look at the filters here on the front, you know, it is a three stage filter. The first thing that's gonna happen when the water comes in is this first stage here, and this is the composite filter. So this is gonna, um, take care of all the sediment coming in, and it actually has carbon in it as well um, to go ahead and be removing VOCs and things out of the water, pesticides even. So then second stage is gonna be our reverse osmosis membrane, which is the top system here, the top filter. Um, and so this is where that tightly bound or tightly wound fabric is that creates pure water when it comes out the other side. And then last is the carbon block. And so this is gonna help with the overall taste of the water before it actually comes out of the faucet. Um, but again, this is neat because it's all self-contained, nice vertically stacked here. And it's gonna sit flat in the bottom of your cabinet. It's got rubber feet on the bottom, whereas a traditional system would mount to the, to the wall, this is just gonna sit still in the bottom of your cabinet. So that's a very nice deal. It does have power to it. I mentioned the booster pump. And the other things that it does besides the pump, it has indicator lights on the front and it's gonna tell you um, when the filters need to be changed out, which is nice because if you're like me, you can never remember when you changed your filters last. So this will be a, um, a really good tool for that. And also the built-in buzzer, it has an indicator in it, a, a buzzer that's, that'll alert you when there's a problem. And reading through the instruction book, it'll tell you things like low pressure, no water, a leak, which is a really big one. It's gonna alert you if it detects a leak inside this cabinet. Um, so that's a really nice feature to add to um, a reverse osmosis system. But it does require power, like we said. So if you don't have power under your sink or wherever you're gonna install this, you need to figure out a way to get that ran prior to install. So there's one thing I really like about iSpring's products is that they ship you everything you need to install it. So this thing, this unit comes with both the faucet, the supply line, the drain line, even the saddle valve where that water is gonna discharge um, and all the clips and needed parts and pieces. And also, most importantly, it comes with a very good instruction manual that's easy to follow. It's, it makes for a really nice DIY install. You don't have to be a plumber to install this, which makes it very convenient. One thing we should talk about is cost. So this is a you know five to $600 unit, depending on when you're purchasing it or where you're purchasing it. And that's gonna be somewhat about double of a traditional tank reverse osmosis system. 
But if you look at the, the pros of using a tankless, depending on where you're installing it, um, that additional cost really is worth it. And when you think about how much space you're saving and how much water you're saving due to the efficiency of it. It also comes in a um, black or a brushed nickel faucet. And it has a standard, you can also get a normal carbon block filter like this one, or you can have the alkaline version if you need that. If you're not already following iSpring on Instagram or YouTube, you should do so to find out all the new products coming out and to find out more of the products that you may already have. Guys, I hope you learned a little bit about it. And just remember, this is available on amazon.com and 123filter.com. I hope you enjoyed today's video.